Oh, Don't punch me. Kill this guy. Guys, way. destroying me. Help me. Help me. Take him out. So what, what do you think of our little fan club so far? There's more. I think you should have probably ducked. Morgan. It's time we got out of here, man. Come here, you naked I need to get out of here. This is scary. I'm running. I'm running, Morgan. I'm running. I'm running behind you. Damn. <laughs> I'm ready to get the fuck out of here. Go get the fuck out of Dodge. I'm trying. This to isn't run. Dodge. I'm never coming to the projects again, Morgan. Yeah, well, I told you. Detroits aren't fun. Like, I had some crazy cracker punch me in the face. Believe that shit. Yeah, I think Jackie Chan by day took him out, though. Hello! Can you guys still hear me? I'm in the street, I haven't got anything out. Hey there. Well it is you innit, not a sound b I think so. Oh. Uh, yeah, I'm <laughs> I don't know why you said be gentle. Um can you give me a saline bag? Alright. Oh, somebody's back to the future and over there. Yeah, yeah, he's alright. But this is gonna be like a Charlie Chaplin film, dude. If you don't give me a, if you don't give me a blood bag, people aren't gonna enjoy watching it in black and white. Yeah, we're quite new to the game. I don't know how to give a saline bag, so yeah, talk us through and I'll give it. Okay, so yeah, it's appeared, and you've just you've just got to put it in your hand, dude, and just whack it in my arm. Try and hit a vein. Might me, might might help me out. I don't want to inflate like a balloon when you squeeze it in. Is that what happens? <laughs> there you go. Okay. Alright, mate. Yeah. That worked. Sweet. Yeah, I've successfully geared. Oh. I don't think I'm full blood, though. I'm a little bit more coloured. Yeah, I think I heard it. Yeah. I think I heard it do not give so much back now, does it? I suppose blood bags used to be pointless if this gave you all it. Oh crap, I'm wearing a pink hat. I thought it was grey. Yeah, it's definitely pink, mate. Good luck for you. I'm going to be attracting all the dudes. I actually read Grimes now. With my cowboy hat on. And my magnum. Not sure about the goose feather coat, but I suppose we haven't seen The Walking Dead in the winter yet. <gasps> Somebody took out Carl. Well, that's a good thing. Because even though he's my son, he he wears my hat too often, and I like this hat. I should look like that guy at an SKS. So I'm gonna see if I can. I don't think anybody heard me. Well, I might be able to defib him. I've got a defib. If he just died. I heard this works like it. I, mean, I don't know how quick I've got to be, but. Alright. Well, it's pristine, so hopefully we're not going to electrocute him. I could be a proper survivor saver. Can't use a defib on a dead person. I'm pretty sure in real life, if you used it on anything other than somebody who'd got their heart stopped, you'd probably kill them. So, well, that's ruined the realism for me. Because <laughs> if you use a defib on an unconscious person, that would kill them, right? Wouldn't it in real life? Anyway, I'm just going to shoot this guy. Make sure he doesn't weigh back up, as he is now properly dead. And he has indeed got a scares. They've actually added in two new guns. The other one's on my back. That's a, um, a B-95, a Blaze 95. But I haven't got any rounds for that yet. You can also get a suppressor for the pistol, I've heard, as well. But I don't know how good the SKS is going to be, because it fires like shortened 
So I'm thinking it's probably going to be several body shots, which is not very good. Oh, it sounds meaty though. Wow, that's louder than the Mosin. Oh, it's got a, like a stripper clip. It's such a recall, a cool reload animation. I bet that sap load is how you load load the blaze. Never trust anyone, but your friends and me. This is how I survive in DayZ. You ever wondered if you die at the time? Read these rules. I'm going to leave them on this piece of paper, just, just in 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 one of the hospitals, and then if anybody finds them, they will survive forever. But I wanted to show you some other stuff that they put in the patch at the moment. Uh, since I've found quite a bit of it, I figured out how to load the blaze as well. You can just load ammo into it and then also into the snap loader, and it basically lets you do both. But I found a pilot's helmet that I've never seen before. One of those old kind of Soviet ones. Um, but I think I'm probably going to stick with the Rick Grimes set, I don't know. I also found... Okay, it doesn't work. I thought you could put these on you. Oh, you can! I found a burlap sack. <laughs> of course it makes your screen black. <laughs> but <laughs> I've heard if you re-log, then you can just run around with a sack on your head and have vision. But this is supposedly for when you handcuff people, you can put a burlap sack on the head, and then I guess at some point they're going to let you, like, transport them like you can in, in Armour 3, and, and put them in your car and take them somewhere. But I don't like that. <laughs> and this is the backpack you can make with the sack and some rope I think or is it a sack and a twig it's one or the other but I only hold 12 sob I kind of like it because it's sort of like a cool sort of survivory backpack so that might be kind of like a good hardcore challenge backpack I guess the uh, the courier bag if you want to if you want to toughen up in Daisy oh, oh fuck's sake it's actually broken my leg and it's ruined my pants. Oh, this game. <laughs> Still not as pissed though as a uh, player called Feedback was back in the mod when a bandit called Dog killed him. This is our story about a guy named Dog. He plays in a BT and he combat logs. He can't shoot for shit and never had a good hit. And all his kills are fresh spawns. Cause Dog is a melon. He's a, a big smelly dog melon Yes, dog is a melon He's a, a big smelly dog melon When you see a chopper crash, it's probably him He can't find, he can barely swim He plays Mantoa and Zilla and the crew They all suck a lot harder than me or you Cause dog is a melon He's a, a big smelly dog melon Yes, dog is a melon. He's a, a big smelly dog melon. And he tried to shoot me with a DMR. He didn't get far. Yes, he tried to shoot me with a DMR. He didn't get far. Cause dog is a melon. He's a big smelly dog melon and he plays with veteran who's also a melon and they all think that Toa is cool but he's really a tool cause dog is a melon his dog is a melon that dog is a melon that dog is a melon that dog is a melon Oh, they were the days. Days gone by when the apocalypse had just started. It's raining outside, so I thought I'd show you something else. Found a Mosin and a spray can. 
Shit bandit down there. Know what he's up to. Um, but one of the new things you can do as well is you can spray paint your Mosin. I think. Did. Now that's cool. As you can see, it's gone from being brown to like a kind of cool World War II trenches green kind of colour. I wish you could get like a stripper clip for these though, or whatever they're called. You know, so you could just click reload instead of having to drag stuff in your inventory. That's cool. That's the guy on the on the industrial building. I think he just shot that other dude who was running past with the, the fire extinguisher. Hmm, he's dead. <laughs> Good iron sight. That was like th 200, 200 meters there. You know, the best thing about headshots is gear that isn't ruined. See, all this stuff is in still pretty good condition. That shit did down there as well. I don't think he's armed because he's like the way he's lying prone, his, his hand is in the wrong position for him to be holding a gun. He's alive though. Hey, man. Hit it. Come up here, man. Oh. Human contact. I oh, did. Can, can you just stay down there whilst I loot this guy? This is another dead guy outside who this guy shot. Yeah, I'm friendly, man. So you don't want this guy coming up the stairs and just Mike Tysoning me in the head. I don't know if he can hear me. Since one punch can knock you out in this game. Which is just absolutely crazy. I just want to know if he comes up the stairs I'm going to have to shoot him. Okay, we're good. I think. But he can have the the rest of this stuff on here, like this SKS and stuff. Okay, the bullet went through his backpack. <laughs> Range led up a bit, which is nice. But I wanted to show you this as well. At these bushes, you can uh, you can pick berries. Well, you should be able to, but for some reason, every bush doesn't have a single berry. So somebody has been Trying to make a berry pie, isn't it? Because I haven't managed to find any berries yet. But it's only at these these bushes that look like this, the dark green ones. If you eat them off the light green ones, they'll poison you and probably end up killing you if you haven't got any of those charcoal tabs to to settle your stomach. Well, I was going to show you berry picking, but game says no. B95. Kind of feel like, like Frank from, from Once Upon a Time in the West, Henry Fonda's character in that film. When well, I've got this gun, so cool. But what I wanted to try, since I made it all the way down to Electra, was uh, the walkie-talkie, which I managed to pick up, bag of Barazino. Now, supposedly on this, once you've got it on. You can hear other people's frequencies and stuff, so... And you see, you change with the full stop button to the radio channel, and then you can speak into it, and I think once it's on, you can just hear whoever's talking. So I'm going to try a couple of... 999 at 210, do you come in? 
Hello? Roger. You're coming in an all frequencies. Hello? Over. Roger, are you there? Hello, over. Incoming airstrike. Okay. Hello? Hello, over. Reading you all clear. Hello there. I am receiving you. This is Golf Oscar Delta. I am reading you on this frequency. Are you in Electro, over? Oh, yes. I, I'm in Electro. I didn't think anyone was on this walkie-talkie business, but... Yes, I, I'm reading you all clear. Well, my name's Frankie. I'm a survivor living in Electro. I've been broadcasting on these AM frequencies every day. At midday, when the sun has been highest in the sky. And you're the first person out there that I've been able to contact, but if you want, man, I can provide food. No shelter, because it hasn't been added in yet, but security. So, you're not alone, man. You actually sound very familiar. I might have seen you in a couple of films back before the apocalypse. Mr. Freeman, is it? Well, that used to be my old life. I used to be famous. I used to be a famous Hollywood actor. I used to come from the land of the United States of America. But now I'm stuck here, here in this third world country, filled with bandits and lack of food. Well, I don't want to be here anymore, but you know, I'm doing what I can to get by, using my Hollywood will and my desire to get back to reality. Are you safe down there? Shall we meet on the, the South Street Seaport? Over? Well, I'm relatively safe, you know. Relatively safe. I mean, I have been captured a number of times. Shot in the face. Why, the things I've had to do with no pants on for a Snickers bar, you won't believe. It'll make any man cry. <laughs> Over. Come at me, boy. You want some of this? Pretty nice. <laughs> People are definitely going to give us our trousers. Oh, they will. Well, I, I can I can think of a number of soup recipes I can do with testicle. <laughs> Doctor. Morgan, I found a fact. Morgan Freeman. You like Shawshank Redemption? Yeah, he's... Uh, all right, Shawshank Redemption. Good for me, yeah, good for me. Oh, thank you very much, thank you. We've got to keep this man alive or Shawshank right. Redemption 2 is not going to happen. Yeah. It's very important. And you so, can count on your sweet ass that Bruce Almighty 2 won't happen if you don't protect my ass. I think it's, uh, I think it's this shit talking is going to last forever, yeah? You want me to kill him? Alright. Back to the hole with you. Yeah. Get out of here. Son of a bitch. Have a nice day. Goodbye. Try and hustle me out of autographs. Right. Son of a bitch. <laughs> and it's a common Detroit, Detroit smackhead. I don't trust them. Oh fuck, there's people at the hospital as well. Dude, we're just gonna have to. We're just gonna have to run across this street. Just have to go for it. Go, 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 go. Alrighty. Oh. Oh dear. Don't, Don't fire. Don't fire. I'm a, I'm a Hollywood actor. Hollywood actor. <laughs> ah, ah. My spleen. My spleen. You sons of bitches. You sons of bitches. <laughs> Get your bandage, dude. I'll keep an eye out. My God. You good? You bandage? I'm bleeding. Do you want me to bandage you? I need a bandage. Wait a minute. It's okay, this game is uh, its not having any of it. I can feel blood dripping. Why oh, can't I me. bandage you? Morgan, no! I try. I'm, I'm bandaging, I'm bandaging you, dude. That's good. I can put my pants back on. Why did you take them off? I don't know. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Did that work? You're still bleeding. No, no, I am not. no longer bleeding. You dried up, right? I am. Now stand still, Morgan. I'm gonna. Those nasty peeps are still across there, but I'm gonna give you a. Um... I can't walk properly. Some medicinal narcotics. Yeah. You can hear them. I wonder what gun that is. Mosin, maybe. Well, they changed all the sounds, didn't they? Which is a bit of a pain, to be honest. Yeah, they're literally just inside here. Yeah, 
Who's this guy? Don't know if we just managed to kill this guy or what? Yeah, okay. One of them's down. Did you pop a cap on his ass? I popped it somewhere. Well, no autographs today, sonny boy. Stick that in your pipe and smoke it. Holy smokes! There's gunshots from everywhere. Oh, he's alive! He's alive! Oh my god. You what saved the me! What the fuck? <laughs> you saved me. I did actually just save you then. Damn, he was gonna unload all kinds of hell. Alright, you loot him. I'll loot his ass. This is Detroit. <laughs> Welcome to the projects, motherfucker. He's definitely dead now. Holy shit, this guy had so much stuff. Nice pistol. I'll have some of that. Right, we have to Thank take cover again, Morgan. Oh, hell is breaking loose. Watch out! Oh, dear. It's okay, I saved you again. Okay, now, Morgan, I think we're in a bit of a tight... I think we're in a bit of a tight spot I hear here. Wild West music. Can you hear that? Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> Do you oh hear that? Oh, God. Yeah, I can hear that, dude. It sounds like it's coming from the orange building. Oh, fuck. It's like... <laughs> once upon a time in the West here. Wild, it's like wild seven West. men versus... I always versus wanted to star in a Wild Wild West movie. Weren't you in Unforgiven? Oh, I got a chance. At my finest role. This is my time to shine. Oh, shit! Cowboys in the street. It's broke back too. Water tight seals get broken. You got no pants, man. I would run. Gunshot. Getting shot at. <laughs> the cowboys are getting shot at. Or are you getting shot at? I don't know anymore. Excuse me. Don't run across Excuse the street. Me. I'm a famous Hollywood actor. Some weirdos playing Indian music. Have you made friends, Morgan? Can I star in your Wild Wild West movie? <laughs> How haven't you been shot yet, Morgan? Oh, the good bit of the Rick Roll. I used to be in Hollywood. Have you seen Shawshank Redemption? Why have they got no pants on? So nobody can steal them, that's why. Keep away, any paparazzi. There's a paparazzi right there. Take him. There, there we go. Good job. I think, I think I'm the paparazzi you're talking about. Oh, I'd run, Morgan. Run, Morgan. I'm dead. I'm <laughs> dead. You're not dead. He was hostile. I had taken that. Who's this? I feel like. Right, I killed the. I killed the cowboy. Oh my god. What the fuck is going on here? I'm dead. Who's are you dead? Morgan, no! I'm not dead, but I'm still I'm doing the Detroit roll. Morgan, roll to me, I can bandage you. No, we're saving him. Wait, you're bleeding as well. We need to save this guy. Cowboy, defend us. Quick bandage him. What is this? Is that a screaming, you asshole? Dude, take your t-shirt off and rip it up. We need to bandage Morgan. Strip! <laughs> what, what the fuck happened to the other cowboy? I don't think the crisps are going to help you. Quick bandage him. Well, maybe just for just pleasure, you know. Pleasure, you know. Taste. Morgan. Bandage my ass. Bandage my ass. I've got to fix your leg, Morgan. What we need... What do you need to craft a bandage? I need to look it up. You mean a splint? Yeah, what do you need for it? Oh, for fuck's sake. A what happened? Just what happened? Don't, don't, don't step out. Don't step out. Jamie Foxx is dead. Jamie oh, Fox my is God. Dead. Oh, my God. He was such a talented actor. A talented actor. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Yeah, th there's a dude there, Morgan. He's not, he's not friendly. Nobody's ever friendly in this game. How talented an actor I am. Maybe then they'll <laughs> spare my life. Oh, shit. And I'm down. You're down? 
I'm down. <sighs> For fuck's sake. Goodbye, cruel world. Everybody's dead. Born in the projects, died in the projects. Well, you did your job. I tried my very best, dude. <laughs> you tried. Oh, yes, you tried your very best. But unfortunately, your best wasn't good enough. I'm gonna avenge you, Morgan. And they pop out. You would not have died in vain. One down. There's fucking cowboys everywhere. It's okay. I got a favor. I asked a favor for the from the big guy upstairs. I'm alive again. He resurrected you. Yeah, yeah. I see him on a regular basis nowadays. I'm a long ways away, but you know, gotta do what you gotta do.